Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel and today I'm doing a review on Rye Boats and Audio Video Capture Card. I'm going to try to keep this as less techy as possible because I'm not really a techy uh, type of guy. But I'm going to provide you with enough information that you will know what this product does and how to use it. So let's get right into the review. So what we have here is a USB 3.0 and what this actually means, this has a faster rate of transferring data. So this means that when you're capturing um, your screen recording or live broadcasting, you will have a less lag time and less delay in your recording. So that's actually really good. And this is why I purchased the USB 3.0. So this is also a full HD 1080p. That means you're gonna get one of the best uh, high resolution uh, quality with this. It also has a 60 Hertz and what 60 Hertz means that the screen is refreshing itself 60 times within a second. So that's pretty good. It also has a 60 uh, second uh, frame per second. So that means uh, your audio and your screen and everything is going to process a lot quicker by, by the frame rate. Another great thing that I actually like about this capture card is that it's a 4K Ultra 8 uh, HD. So with this, you're going to just have really, really good uh, quality uh, resolution. And when you want to play your um, record your consoles like the PlayStation or the Xbox or Nintendo Switch, and this is what I'm going to show you how to do it with, you're going to have some good resolution. This um, is also compatible with um, Twitch, um, Facebook, Skype, Xbox, and the OBS um, streaming platform um, software. And I'm going to go ahead and show you that later. I'm also going to show you right now what it comes with so you can get a better understanding of the parts to it. All right, so as I promised, it comes with um, one capture card. And it's kind of actually lightweight. feels like it's made out of aluminum. So, yeah. See that it can go, it could take a bit of damage. And then it also comes with uh, one HDMI cable here. So this HDMI is going to connect to the capture card. I'm going to show you all of that later. And we also have here, we got the USB uh, 3.0, a USB cord. And that's everything that comes with this one each. All right, so let's take a look at the ports on this capture card. So right here in the front, we have the port for the USB uh, 3.0 that with that blue cord. And then you also have for your uh, microphone and your headset right here. And then it also has like a LED light, excuse me, that comes on when you connect everything. And in the back ports, you have a HDMI output and an HDMI input. And yeah, so I'm going to go ahead and show you how to set this up. And I'm going to be using the software OBS and um, yeah, it's a free download. It doesn't come with this particular product. You can just look online and uh, with that software, you can like stream your, uh, you can live stream or you can uh, record your gameplay or broadcast in live, wherever you, uh, you particularly want to do. But for this um, video, this review, I'm just going to go ahead and connect it to my switch, my console. And yeah, go ahead and show you how that looks like. So the first thing I do when I want to connect my capture card and start recording my uh, screen, um, I'm going to go ahead and take the USB 3.0 cable. I'm going to go ahead and plug it right here where it says the USB 3.0 and it also has a blue identifier right here. So go ahead and plug this in to that side. The next thing I'm going to do, I'm going to take the other end. I'm going to plug it to the USB on the computer. The next part, I'm going to go ahead and take the HD and my cable from my switch and I'm going to go ahead and plug this inside the it's going to be the uh, HDMI input I'm going to plug that into the input I took this the HDMI cable from the switch and I put it inside the input of the capture card all right followed by that I'm going to go ahead and take the HDMI cable that came with this product I'm going to go ahead and put this inside the output the HDMI output and then the end cable to this part it's going to go directly on the HDMI TV in the back all right I'm going to go ahead and plug that part to the HDMI in the back of the TV all right there we go so everything is already connected and we're going to go ahead and turn the software on all right everyone so as you can see I have 
my um, capture card in use and it's looking okay so i'm going to go ahead and open up this software so you can see how it actually look like like i said this is a free software that does not come with the, um, the nintendo switch it's just uh, one of the um, plat screen streaming platforms that this capture card is compatible with so i'm gonna go ahead and load it up and it's about to pop up in a few seconds all right so there you go right there so as you can see the capture card is recording my screen over there all right, so this is actually a high quality capture card that I definitely recommend. So if you want to uh, broadcast live, you want to do screen recording, this is definitely um, the capture card that you want to have with you. And I just want to say uh, thank you for taking the time to watch the review. Um, this is, uh, I'm not really a techie person, but I did a lot of research on this and this is something that my son wanted, capture card. And like I said, this is simple, easy to use and uh, yeah. Thank you for watching the video.